Hey everyone, Mr. Uncover here. Today, sadly, we are leaving North Carolina oh. to go down to Helen. It's kind of weird saying down to Helen because normally we go up to Helen. The view here is beautiful, but sadly, we have to leave. So, we're going to go up to Helen, see if we can metal detect the, um, what's that place called? The gold mine place. And we're gonna go to the coin store over there, see if we can get some good coins. Oh, there's my bottle right here. Um, yeah, so it should be fun. Today's New Year's Eve, so by the time this video is out, it'll probably be New Year's. So, Happy New Year's and hello 2020. Man, that feels so weird to say. But, um, I can't wait to see that date on coins. Well, yeah, so that way I can get, um... I have some uncirculated rolls of 2019, so I'm gonna get some uncirculated rolls of 2020 just so I can sell them one day. Yeah, when I'm a grandpa, those coins are like 75 years old, so an uncirculated roll of shield pennies. That's gonna be crazy. Um, yeah, so we're gonna go up to Helen and uh, see you guys when we hit the road. Whoa! Yeehaw! Look at this glasses. It looks like it. I thought it was dead. I thought it was gonna run away. Oh my, that was loud. Oh yeah! Oh, there's an ash. You were close. Whoa! I like that one too. Wow. No, I don't have. Oh my god. Go. Oh. Whoa, that is like in space. Oh. <laughs> close to in space, very close. <laughs> You'll be okay. Jeez. Oh, yeah. I'm glad they didn't do that one. Ash. Ash. I'm not dead though. I'm okay. Oh. Dang it. Yeah. The only one I did. Oh, it was like showing up. Uh-oh. You guys were lighting. That was weird. You guys were that weird. Imagine being scared right now. Imagine being close. That one almost hit a tree. So guys, I'm going to jump in real quick here. Um, I wanted to make some things clear. If you heard me during the fireworks saying well i survived and logan saying i almost died the reason for that is um because we were lighting the fireworks at one point and so one of them went off really low and it was one of the ones where it exploded it was supposed to have the like the gold swirly screaming things go up it start, went up so high and then started coming back down when it exploded all those things came shooting down at us and we're like almost got hit so we were like, oh my gosh, we almost died. So that's why that's there. And uh, yeah, on with the show. Wow. Beautiful and cold. This view's amazing, but it's freezing. We are in Helen, and we just stopped by the coin store to pick up some more stuff, so... Let's go ahead and show you what we got. Whoa, okay. Here it is. First coin, 1961 Denver Silver Quarter. Uh, next on the list is 1945. I think it's Philly. Nope, Denver. Mercury Dime, pretty, pretty nice looking. Whoo, what is this? You don't normally see me picking up uh, foreigns, but I mean, if you look at the back, first of all, the front, it just looks like a real. I mean, it's beautiful. Sorry if my hands are dirty. I just went metal detecting and got so many coins. But I didn't get anything old, so I didn't make a video. Yeah. Um, Almost one was a 73. 67. Um, uh, 1897, one shilling. That is quite a coin. Quite a coin. That is beautiful. I just I'm gonna display it on this side. And then next 
Look at the toning on this stinking large son. 1842. Braided hair, large son, right, Lily? Uh -huh. Braided hair, yep. It's got some dinging on the back, but. I've got a 1841 braided hair. Close. Dude, that's beautiful. Now let's move over to Logan's. He picked up two, but man, did he get a good deal on these. Yeah. Go ahead. Alright, so I've got this 1851A Austria coin. Uh, well, oh, we don't move it so fast. That's what this says. It this doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. Austria. It's, it's actually Australian coin. No, it's from Austria. Oh, well, okay. Not Australian. Oh. Austria is a country. Australians, I could tell. Okay. Anyway, it is an Australian coin. No, it's from Austria, not Australia. I know, it's from Austria, which is... You said Australia. Austria, oh, that's right. Anyway, it's an Austria coin. Um, Let's see the back again, what's yeah, the date? The, that's actually the front. Oh, one cruiser? Cruiser? I don't know, one cruiser. Cruiser, I don't know. 1851A. That's pretty old. Now let's go to this but, thing. Huh, no, no, let me see. It says... He can't speak Austrian, guys. Put uh, it down and go to the trime. Oh, I said it. I mean, three-cent nickel, not a trime. Okay, here. Huh. You don't see me picking up these a lot. You don't see them a lot. Anyway, these are... Oh, why did I say these are... This is a 1867... Three cent piece. Beautiful. Beautiful as it says. United States of America. Yeah, it's just a beauty. It, I don't know, Brandon. Are they silver? No, they're made, they're, they're made of nickel. That's what I thought. Because they're a nickel. Actually, wait. They're three cent pieces. They're made of nickel. That's a three cent nickel, not a trime. A trime's made yeah, of silver. A trime is made of silver. That looks a lot like a trime, though. Well, they but it's look, not. When you, they, when you go to the back, you're like. They look yeah. the same. They just One of them's made of silver, one of them's made of nickel. Yeah. Okay, so this at first was thirty-one dollars. So is he pretty, gave us. This guy gives us good deals, and uh, at the end of this video, we'll throw up his um, Count. his uh, what you call it, his uh, business card. Business so you guys should definitely go check him out if you guys are near the North Georgia area. Here's an up close look at that uh, silver quarter. And you can see it's pretty good. Let me flip it over to the back. You can see it is a Denver Mint mark. Pretty good detail. But you know, I just got that for the silver value. Now let's go look at the Merc. The Merc, I did the same thing. It's pretty good. But uh, it's mainly just for the silver. Um, it's pretty nice. Flip it to the back. The back's pretty good. I mean, I've seen it better. But, you know, it's pretty good. Uh, now let's go look at the one shilling. This was probably my favorite coin of the pickup. It just looks so good. It's worn, but man, does it look cool on the back side, especially. Let's go ahead and look at the back. Yeah, I mean, that's just beautiful. I mean, sorry I'm just like shaking so much. Just because it's kind of hard to do what I'm doing right now. But that's a beautiful coin. Now let's move on to uh, the large scent. As you can see, it's an 1842 braided hair large scent. Uh, it, yeah, man, I'm trying to get the uh, the colors to come out of it, but they won't come out. But you can see it's pretty much full liberty up at the top. And uh, decent detail. We'll flip it over to the back. Yeah, the back's pretty corroded, but you know... That's why I display the front. <laughs> it's uh, pretty ugly on the back, but you know. Pretty much a 200-year-old coin. Okay, and now let's move on to Logan's coins. Here's uh, Logan's Trime. Well, three-cent nickel, not Trime. As you can see, it's got full liberty. 1867, beautiful coin. Let's flip it to the back. And the back is just as good. It's just, it's just a beautiful coin. 
I'm honestly jealous of this. But you know, he he used his own money, so good for him. And uh, now let's move on to the oldest, no, not the oldest, one of the oldest coins of the pickup. It is a Austrian coin from 1851. I don't know what it's called. I, I mean, it, it looks like Cruiser, but there's probably a, a, like a weird way of saying it. But look, I just love the attention to detail on this coin. And uh, we'll flip it to the back. I don't know which the front or the back. This might be the back, but I'm going to flip to the other side. And the attention to detail still is on this side. I mean, look at that dual-headed eagle. Or whatever that is. Beautiful coin. Yep. Alright. Um, now on to the next clip.